Hi there, welcome to this tutorial about how to upload your own Schoology hyperlink or hybrid doc banner. So what this is, is just a, a easy and accessible way for students of any age, especially from kinder on, to go ahead and become more independent in Schoology. So what can happen is that I've already created this template with the invisible table. So when you guys select it, you'll see that it's a table with the white border and each badge that I've created is completely editable. So then you can go ahead and click and you can customize the color, you can customize the font, and you can customize the size of the font. If you're actually wanting to make this uh, more accessible for younger students, you can go ahead and actually add the image here. You can Google it, download it to your desktop, and then upload it. Once you're done customizing all of your badges, you're going to make sure that all of them are hyperlinked to the correct website that you want it to be. For example, my reworks.org, I have my social studies of textbooks that we have, typing.com, Freckle, Flipgrid, and our library, Find a Book. You're more than welcome to even, and some more ideas that you could do is uh, probably by category, but social studies, reading, writing, just some great ideas um, or even tools for the students to use while they're working. So once it's all done, you're going to go ahead and put edit, select all, edit, copy. And you're going to go to your Schoology course. This is my practice one. I'm going to go ahead and delete this one just to kind of show you guys what's going to happen. All right. So once I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and press post, copy, paste. Very important. Make sure you press this announcement button. Once you click that, you press post. And it will automatically go to the very top of your uh, updates. And when your students are actually working, they'll be able to see their folders and the links at the same time. So the great thing about this is if, for example, for reading this week, they had to go ahead and do 30 minutes of reading on Freckle, they can just click on the Freckle button. And it'll automatically lead them to the student login. Uh, let's say they need to do brain pop or vocabulary and they need to do uh, the social studies um, assignment. They can go ahead and click on that and automatically lead them to brain pop. Now, the great thing and the most flexible thing about this is that once you've created it once, you're just uh, you can go back and customize it and add some more badges, um, maybe fix a broken link or update something. So this is a great way to make it kid-friendly for all ages and for all abilities. Hope you have a great time customizing.